Hello, Teaching Online 201. This is Todd Conaway here on a beautiful Friday afternoon in Bothell here. Uh, looking forward to at least one mostly sunny day this weekend. Uh, the weather has been freezing but beautiful. Uh, so you're looking at our homepage uh, in this short video and you're looking at the class in student view, even though, of course, I am one of the teachers. Uh, when you make videos or you're making course tours, use the student view so that the students see the course they are familiar with, not the course you are familiar seeing, because you see things differently, right? I want to point out a couple things here and uh, the calendar. Um, you all have just completed your uh, assignments regarding using images. Uh, those were due on the second. Uh, and you have a couple uh, assignments coming up here that are due on the 6th and the 9th. Uh, you can see those over here in the to-do list, right? So this is a great thing to point out for students, a uh, way to keep them on track and, and doing the work. Uh, it shows you a nice list in chronological order of all the things that are due. <clears throat> the course calendar in Canvas is an amazing feature. Um, you can see here that, uh, you know, you have the things that are due coming up. When you click on them, you can actually see what they are, and you can actually go to them and do them right here. Um, and you can see from a student's perspective, you can see multiple courses, and they're all color-coded, and it's just very nice. Uh, you can see it in the month view or the agenda view. Uh, Either way, they look uh, very nice and, and it's a great way to share with students how to uh, see their coursework. So anyway, uh, when you make tours, use Student View. You all have some assignments uh, that are coming up uh, early next week. And um, I wish you a wonderful, wonderful weekend.